Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? Big Porky here, and still, hmm, you know don't you, you know, still the voice of hardcore boxing. Right, it's getting late now so I'm ready to go home, it's been a long day. Uh, Alexander Alexander Usek, has he been signed by Eddie Earn to be kept away from Anthony Joshua? Well, he's a matchroom fighter, isn't he? Joshua's a matchroom fighter. They both got gold medals at Olympics. One a super heavyweight, one a heavyweight. They're both now fighting at heavyweight, but Joshua's obviously, he was a lot bigger than him in amateurs, but two gold medalists from London Olympics, right? They're both under the matchroom banner. Usyk's undefeated. He's cleaned up and won every belt at, super, at cruiserweight. And he's moved up to heavyweight now in pros. Joshua's one defeat, but he's got four belts out of the five. It's easy. He's very easy fight to make, but he's fought Chaz Witherspoon, who's, who's lost several losses, and he's fighting Del Boy Chisora, who's now looking for his tenth loss. You're doing that to a gold medal Olympian, who's a undisputed cruiserweight champion, southpaw, undefeated, and pound for pound but yet it's fighting Derek Chisora is he has he been signed so to protect Joshua well has he Joshua didn't want to go near Luis Ortiz did he Eddie Hearn signed Ortiz when he was undefeated he was a two-time Olympian undefeated were he 22 and 0 southpaw he gave him two fights he had two fights one of them were with Dave Allen Doing that to Luis Ortiz. WBA interim guy, he was the main guy at the WBA chasing Vladimir. And Eddie Hearn didn't upgrade him to regular champion or didn't push to get him a world title fight. He just signed him and put him out of the way. Is he doing that with Alex Alexander Usek? And it remains to be seen, doesn't it? But he's put a stop gap in there. Derek Chisora, he's had Chaz Witherspoon. But he's telling us that he needs to. Uh, be, be seen with public and all that and get known to us. We already know who Usek is, a gold medalist. He won the World Boxing Super Series tournament at Cruiserweight. He moves up to heavyweight and he's just, he's going nowhere. He's on Skid Row. He's going nowhere. Chisora, come on. How many more times can they recycle Chisora? Eddie, Eddie you said yourself that he, he, Chisora was spent after the Caballel fight. So why you keep recycling him? Get Usek in the in mix with Dylan White and get him in with Anthony Joshua. Stop messing about and not giving us what we want. Fans are going to turn off. They'll turn off and that's what will happen. But I think Usek's been signed like Otters to be parked up to protect Joshua. Protect the cash cow. They've got to protect the cash cow. It's like having a, a queen and a king on, on your chessboard. You have your rooks and your bishops and your I was going to say prawns, then it's pawns, and it pawns and uh, castles, or is that a rook? I forget anyway now. I used to play a lot of chess when I was doing porridge, but many years ago. But they're, they're protecting the king and the queen, aren't they? Dylan White's the queen, Joshua's the king. Usek's protecting them. That's what's happening. And, and Derek Chisora to a certain extent, but he's a spent force in Chisora. But we want to see the fights, don't we? I mean, I've just done, done a video yesterday, Anna, regarding, you know, all the fighters, the, the fights that he could made, that could have made, whether 11 or 12 fights that he, he could make, maybe more. I mean, you could even throw Savannah Marshall, Clarissa Shields in that, but Shields is not an Eddie fighter, is she? Or is she? I don't know. Has he got links to her? I don't know, but Savannah Marshall's a match from fighter, isn't it? The fights are not getting made, and I think Alexander Usek, he, he's with Eddie Earn at the moment, isn't he? But they're not delivering for, for him, are they? That's just my opinion. So, peace out. Keep on trucking, keep sporting boxing, don't have nightmares.